Good morning, everybody. Thank you for coming back to my channel. It's Lena again. Um, so today, what I wanted to show you guys is the DB method. Um, so what I wanted to show you about it is one, how it, how it um, works, how I use it. And I also wanted to tell you the reasons that I was interested in purchasing it because um, it is kind of expensive. But for the reason that I bought it, I thought it was totally worth it. Um, so the reason that I started researching the DB method and bought it over the summer is because I was doing a bunch of squats and trying to do exercises mostly leg related and my knees um, started to really hurt. So I was trying to research ways that I could still do squats because those are exercises that I am interested in doing um, and not hurt my knee. So the DB method machine is designed to help take pressure off your knees, but still allowing you to do a perfect squat. Um, and then you can do different exercises, different levels and all that. So I wanted to show you guys some of the different routine exercises that I do. Um, I do this machine about two to three times a week, but I also um, do another form of exercise other days of the week. So I mix this with other things because sometimes it just doesn't feel like it's enough but it's definitely something that I've grown to enjoy doing because it's quick. It's only 10 minutes a day, they say. <laughs> you can always do more if you wanted, but I like when you say 10 minutes, 10 minutes for me. Um, so it's 10 minutes a day and then you're done. So let's get started and I'll show you how it's used. After you do your exercises, um, like the ones that I showed you is my usual routine or I change it up sometimes, but then I go through and repeat it so that it does equal up to 10 minutes. Then once I'm done with my DB method, I will go make a breakfast smoothie. So I will show you guys how to do that now. All right guys, so I'm gonna show you how to make my favorite breakfast smoothie. So some ingredients that you will need is an avocado. We're not gonna use the whole thing, but avocado, some chia seeds, oat milk a lot. Um, mango chunks, pineapple chunks. Um, you could do frozen strawberries, but at, right now I have fresh strawberries. And then a little bit of vanilla protein. So all this is gonna go into our smoothie cup. And then we are going to have a delicious breakfast smoothie. Thank you. 